I wanna call night. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute. Okay, thank you, number six. Thank you. Jada, Jada, Jada. By the way, just got. All right, hey, y'all. Welcome to Jada Shanette's Truth and Dream. So, um, I got my best friend, Chris, with me here. Hi, guys. Chris, shut yourself out. Hi, I am Chris. I am here. You've probably seen me before. This is nothing new. So I just get ready. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have some fun, y'all. Um, it is 2024. It's the beginning of a new year. I'm feeling good about this year. I feel like this is my money making year. I want to be more consistent on dropping videos for y'all and just to show my appreciation of how much I've grown over the past year. I wanted to do a giveaway. So Ooh. yes, we will be um getting into that later on. But y'all just relax, sit back. We got some questions. Um my girl Dion is here and Dion is going to ask us these questions that I let Instagram and a few other TikTok people, you know, um, ask me different questions online anonymously. So I don't know who asked these questions, which is really crazy. I don't know what these questions are. We haven't seen these questions, but we're going to have fun. The rules are, if she asks a question and we don't want to answer it, we got to take a shot. Okay. All right? Okay. So we cool with that? Yeah. Um, so yeah, Dion. Let's get, let's get this thing popping. Oh, wow. We haven't, we haven't worked together since we did the Santana video. That was technically like my first time like being on a like video Oh yeah. With you. Like actually on set. No, I've been on set with you, but like actually being was in, in the video. video. Yeah. So we recently was in the, um, Saucy Santana 20v1 video, um, mm -hmm. that he did with. What was his name? Unghetto. Um, and what's his name? Chris Shamar. Was, yes, Chris was on the video. You know, it was a close set. So I'm like, you know, I gotta be, I gotta be there for my friend. Yes. He gotta be on set. <laughs> like he gotta do what I do. So I need to be there. Mm -hmm. So I was one of the girls that was, you know, trying to get with Tulsa Santana. But that video clip ended up going viral. Yeah, it's very viral. This right here. Me find out you trying something. I'm not trying nothing. He trying it. He trying it. He trying it, and he trying it. <laughs> hey! Why some real niggas from back there? And then y'all even got no bad hoes. She had no BBL. Her makeup one done. Like, what are we doing? So, like, the hoes need a BBL? Yeah, like, they ain't got no BBLs, no mink lashes, no lace wigs, no nothing. She just came out and said, fuck it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, he talking about the girl that ain't had no makeup, no BBL, no... That was tea. So, anyways, um, we yeah, have Dion's gonna start off asking us questions. Let's go with it. Damn, I need an extra. All right, we're gonna start off real easy now. Okay. Put them phones out because I need y'all last Instagram search. Mm hmm. <sighs> oh. I'm gonna just start off with a shot because I want to take a shot anyway. So I'm gonna just start off with a shot. So we have to show our last Instagram search. Just switch, what's your last Instagram search? Ooh. Let's take a shot. Yeah, take a shot. Oh, okay. Take a shot. Baby, you don't even want to know. Uh uh. Just, mm -mm. All right. Off of privacy. All right. Are you single? If not, say your partner's name or drink. Okay. Sunday night, Sunday night. I don't think we should. I'm not. We taking a shot. You don't know want Sunday night. I'm not single. You don't I'm want not Sunday single. Night? I'm not saying no Take that shot. Because what Drake said, I'm not hiding you from the world. <laughs> I'm hiding the world from you. What's your biggest insecurity? I'll let you go first. Let's see. Do I want to reveal that? <laughs> no. Because you just could never get the one up on a hoe like me. 
You know my insecurity child. <laughs> Shot. You will be fucked up. I can't let a hog in the window on the outside. You could have said a professional answer. Like, that's like them asking what's your what's your um weaknesses and you gotta say a professional answer that's it's a weakness but it's a weakness but it's really not though like I'm a perfectionist what can you say about that? No. Oh well, I wanna be perfect. Like <laughs> no, Ooh, I wanna then, do my job real good. No, but then somebody gonna come around me knowing that I'm a perfectionist and try to screw everything up. They can never get the one up on me, I'm sorry. My <laughs> my biggest insecurity, I feel like I'm insecure about something. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm insecure about something. Mm -hmm. Damn. I'm bi. I've been bi headed for a real long time. Honestly, it's I've been, been some months at most. Six months is a real long time. It's mm. been six months, and don't do that. Don't do that because you're the main one to be calling me like. I just can't wait till you grow your hair back out. Like, don't never do that again. Yeah, because never. And then what you do just a couple of days ago. I just cut it. I just got a new cut, Wookie. <laughs> Next question. What verified follower do you have on IG that had you starstruck when you first saw they followed you? That's for you, babe. Because the only <laughs> verified follower I got. Dude. You lie, I'm gonna make you take two shots. You don't even know who I'm gonna I say. I know who you're gonna say. Who? If you wanna say the name, I'm gonna make you take two <laughs> shots. If she's keep it cute, she's gonna have to take two shots. I dare you to play with Alright, the one that had me starstruck, like, oh my gosh, they follow me. Like, I posted it, I was happy about it, and my close friends and everything. I was like, what? Like, I'm doing something now. Who was it? It was T.I. See how sweet this came, baby. <laughs> she, yeah. Who you thought I was gonna say? That would be messy, bitch. You wanna who? I'm gonna say no, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> the worst industry experience. Of the name. Yo, my work. I only have one industry experience. <laughs> You want to wake that up? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Carol, I know what you're talking about. Can I say something? What? I don't know. I don't want to say it. Wait. Oh, it would be wrong. Oh, she ain't nothing like that mother. Oh. <laughs> and that's the problem. You ain't nothing like that mother. Oh. Wake that tea up. I will. Okay. Wait a tea <laughs> Ski trip, little Tyler. Got Tyler. people thinking I'm a dragon. Would I say fire? Tell all my hoes that I love them, but I'm a liar. I'm Going a liar. through my city, stabbing shit like I'm Michael Myers. Yeah, that's why. That's a lie. But. Oh, no, I'm going to tell mine. Oh, what was yours? Oh, I was Out there, didn't know what to really expect. You know what I'm saying? 
and he didn't speak to nobody really. You know what I'm saying? Like even when the video was over, he was like, um, Shamar had asked, like, you know, can we take a picture? And he was like, no, I'm going to the airport. You know what I'm saying? So it's like stuff like that. I'm not saying you're a bad person. But he really did. It seemed like, you know, like, when you're in, in, in the industry, you commit to things, right? And sometimes you not, might be in that space. So it's not that he's a bad person. It just seems like he committed to something. And when he showed up, it was not given. You know what I'm saying? Question for Jada. Has any artist ever tried to bag you at one of the music videos? And if so, drop the name. If you lie, you gotta take two shots. I need one name. I got a feeling the answer is gonna be multiple people. I need well, one I name. You about to be drunk. I ain't had no way. I ain't had no. Speaking of industries, what kind of industry nigga, if an industry nigga, a rapper, an athlete, or a scammer? Oh, I'm Yeah, 
she was helping me. No, the fuck is <laughs> money? Helping you spend money, bitch. That's not it. That's, that's all I'm guilty for. That nigga, if a nigga scamming, he don't got no morals. He's gonna say, if I'm going down, this bitch going down too. No. You don't think so? No. I think they're cool. But they don't spend a lot of money. Okay. So, uh, Okay. Next question. Who's your celebrity crush? Oh, I don't know if he's a celebrity. But Oh, he is a celebrity. Let me stop. Let me stop playing with my baby. Okay, so I have two. But I'll just go I'll just say my two. Zach Fox. Oh, was that crew here? Zach Fox and Mason Goody and Cuba Goody and Son. Cuba? He's so he was nice looking, so I know his son probably. Oh, his son is gorgeous. Can I show him to you? That's because he's just so gorgeous. Like I don't, I've never had some, I can't say never, but I don't have somebody that I'm like, oh my God, for sure. I want to take him on oh. his balls. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't. Oh, girl. Oh, he you looks like, like somebody you would like. I know, he's so cute. How much money do you make? I'm this. People want to know, it ain't me. I just feel like that's a weird question to ask somebody. Like, I feel like it's so personal. It's personal. But if I know you, I'll tell you. Yeah. But not for the internet. I feel like when people look at you on the internet and they have this, this opinion about you, some people can't even fathom living how I live, like having a Tesla, having my own house, like, you know, being a mom on top of that. They can't fathom that, so they have these outrageous things in their mind. So it's just like, that's weird to me that y'all want to know my business like that. You feel me? Like, I'm selling coochie. I'm that I don't bitch. Gotta rap. Cheers. I know that's right, bitch. Is that a name? What the fuck is that? Gosh. All right, Ooh. let's get personal, Jada. Oh, Jada. I want to know what happened between you and your best friend, Steph. Oh, bitch. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm ready for the tea. It's exceptionally delicious. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't messed me with these. Don't test me. It's <laughs> your bestie, Miss Lusty. Um, Tell the team. I'm ready. Tell it. Let's take a shot. Okay, let me just start off. Now you're going to hold you. You down two shots. I do feel hot. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. I just got it. I just so got it. Oh, my gosh. You don't want to talk about it? Is it too fresh? Is it too new? It's not new. I feel like it's old. Do you feel like you moved on? I have moved on. So you could talk about it. You want to talk about it? You want to tell the folks the tea? So what happened? What happened between me and her? You know you can't go back after this, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I feel like it's, it'll always be love, but I just feel like we're going different paths. When my advice to people is don't let people move into your house. Don't let people move into your house. When your friend going through it, help them, but help them as much as they 
want to help themselves. You feel me? Like, and that's it. Uh, I I don't want to get into the details. I'd rather take a shot. I, I don't want to get into the details of what happened. You know what I'm saying? Just because I don't respect for, you know, what her daughter, what was, like, you know. Yeah. I just feel like I don't want to get into that. But don't let people move into your house. Um, when people start looking and what you got going on and feeling like they obligated to something or you owe them something because you're in a different position than them, just just pay attention. To, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like that's what I can say. Without saying too much, because I'm really not trying to say too much. Like, I want to keep it classy, keep it cute. No bars. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Follow up, follow up. Will you and Steph ever be cool again? I don't have no... It's no pressure. But... I'm good. You don't feel like... I'm good. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm good. I... I'm good. Okay, you good. If she was to come to me, maybe, and say, like, you know, maybe I didn't do that right by you and you was helping me. Maybe, but. I thought it was a sisterhood. That's your opinion. I thought it was. I, th I ain't going to lie, y'all. I took shrooms with Steph once. And I just knew I was like, oh, God told me that's. Well, that's she my sister. Yeah. That's my sister. Like, we have a sisterhood. We're growing together. So, my shroom experience with her makes me look at her a little bit differently. But also, you know, when you going through your own shit, sometimes you do shit that's, that doesn't really show up as who you are, who you want to be. But that's me. Anyways. I don't know if we'll be cool again. I just feel like I'm growing and I don't want to take too many people with me that don't, not deserve, but that can't handle being with me. You know what I'm saying? Where I'm going. Because I just can't imagine how it would be now. If everything was still, you know what I'm saying? If everything was the same without all of that happening, think about all the things that have happened this past year since mm -hmm. she's not here anymore. You know what I'm saying? Imagine what it would be like now if she was still around. Right. What I would be going through. You know what I'm saying? But, anyways. Okay, so <clears throat> what would you do if you found out you had a baby on the way right now? <laughs> Let me just ask you a side question. What's the percentage of me becoming an uncle within the next year or two? Because I ain't trying to have no surprise pop ups. <laughs> I'm trying to see your answer. What would I do if I had a baby on the way? Well, first off, if I had a baby on the way, slap me. Okay? Um, shoot, I guess I would have to let go of the bachelor lifestyle. Um,. My first stop is to get me an SUV, something cute like an X3 or a Volvo XC60. You know, something that gives a dad a stay. Um, of course, I would have to stop my clubbing and stuff, so I would have to let that go. I, I would have to let go of my dreams of snagging a baller because who wants a single father? Because, you know, I'm not going to be with my child's mother or father. I know that. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's the boss babe aesthetic around here. I don't know if you've noticed. 
I don't have time to be co-parenting. <laughs> I'm doing this on my own. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'll just change my life around. You know, just be more responsible. Um, you know, that's it. You? <laughs> if I was that right now? Right now. If I was to what? I used to find out she was pregnant right now. I'm claiming it on my text. No, you're not. Who not? You already got one. Let me have That's all I'm going to have. That same one. Okay. So, fuck. Next question. <laughs> what you going to do if you find your thing right now? I'm going to have one child next year for the taxes. <laughs> Wait, so you mean to tell me what you going to do with the other child? She said, if you were pregnant right now, what you gonna do about that? What you gonna do about that? What you gonna do about that? You gonna do right by it? Or you gonna send it to the chop shop? <laughs> oh, God. It's in heaven. What she gonna do? Not the chop, the chop shop sound better. <laughs> heaven, <laughs> heaven sound better. The heaven does sound better. God didn't want to do that. That would have been that was not God. <laughs> That was not sent by God. God did not want me to have no baby. That was not what he said. If you found out right now, that ultrasound. That is not what he said. No, That ultrasound. was somebody else. That was a bad decision. Like you said, Slutty. That was, I don't know who she was. Who's trying to have a baby in this economy? Why would y'all ask that? This economy <laughs> is as fucked as me right now. Well, and I ain't I'm getting it. I'm a virgin. Please. Oh, baby. What you trying to say? Put your shades back on, baby, because... We're not going to do that because, we know, this is pristine. This is like behind the core over here, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Which one of y'all parents do y'all call for money? Like, they can get you out of bond. She in Georgia. My dad is in North Carolina, so I'm calling my mama. My mama gonna make it happen because she gonna worry herself to death if she don't. Anyways, like she gonna come and get me. So yeah. I'm gonna say my parents. They they team up. They talk. If I call and ask my mom for crazy. something or call my dad for I something, don't be liking that. They're gonna both know. They be because I feel crazy. like it's certain situations that have happened where I told my mom something or I told my dad something, and it was like kind of giving like don't tell the other parent, but then it slipped up later like oh yeah because I was on the phone with your daddy. Like, yes, what you mean? Was on the phone you was on the phone with my Call that parent right now and ask for four hundred dollars because you found out you got a baby on the way. I'm gonna have to take a shot. Simply because I would get cussed out. It is 1218. It's 1218 and I'm waiting. On Monday. Damn, I feel like I can call my mommy right now. I'm gonna have to take a shot. Because I'm not trying to get cussed out. Let's call my mommy. But then she gonna know. What I gotta tell her? You need 400. I got 400. I need 400 dollars. Jada, you gonna start a whole beef with her. Uh uh. Okay, girl. $400? I just call and ask her for 400 She was like, yeah, what I'm going to say is I need $400 for I need $400 for... Because you got a baby on the way. I'm not saying that to her. That's what it no, say. That's say. That's what it say. It say, say you need 400 because you got a baby on the way. That's why I was segueing like the what if you found out she was pregnant right now to call your mom and tell her you was pregnant right now. <laughs> She's going to cut you off. Did I take my shot already? Oh no, I did it. Okay, let me take my shot because I'm not calling nobody at no 12 20 a.m. on All right.
on someone before. Technically, 
Okay. Say it, say it, say so it, say even it. back in the day, how far back? How far back in the day? Cause I don't remember. I ain't gonna lie. We've been drinking. How far back in the day? You don't never remember. Okay. You we're, gonna cut, remember. we're gonna cut all that. But you don't ever remember getting your lick back on a nigga? No, I feel like I'm probably still. Okay, girl. Let's put the shades on. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. Next question. That's that we got. Call my head top right there. Next question. All right. Me, Name drop one of your celebrity flings. I don't have celebrity things, you guys. Me neither. I don't have any. So. <laughs> what? Sure you know. Are you really my friend? Am I? How did you get over your last breakup? How did you get over your last breakup? Why are you looking at me? Okay. I won't really qualify as my life. It was my situation breakup. Um, I took a flight to Puerto Rico. <laughs> Literally, like. What happened on the flight to Puerto Rico that you felt like? You no, know, so I was living in the airport, and so basically he told me, like, yeah, I ain't with that gay shit, nigga. It wasn't with that gay shit <laughs> anymore. Anymore. So this is anymore. Yeah. Yeah. So this already, is a straight man you talking? Already, you already know who this is. Well, I'm not going to talk about that, but. So you feel like you're talking about your last breakup. So how did you get over it? You feel like? Puerto Rico, babes. I was in San Juan. How did I get over my last breakup? I found a better. I found a better. That was it. Interracial dating. Interracial dating? You want to put that on so bad? What's tea? Yes, yeah, so I'm talking to a Mexican. Ooh. Oh. I, was, I like to put on the spotlight. Cause if I oh, was a, he ain't Mexican. I make tacos, man. Confusing. Girl, bye. You made them want to. Girl. This shit thinks she's Jello. Jello's not Mexican. Jello's Puerto Rican. But she no, is today. queen of interracial dating. But she, you don't get the reference. She played a Mexican, She's like an interracial right? dating. Well, you see me. She's with a white man. And I'm a Puerto Rican. But we got, but, but we, but, but. I'm, I'm a black Puerto Rican. But, but we, but, but, Puerto Rico. Anyway, so, okay. And okay, you're right. Let's see. Yeah, I talked to a Mexican. They want me to tell us. Wait, so quick so question. Is, so what's, the, what's the percentage chance of us getting a construction company within the next four years? <laughs> next question. For Jada, did you ever get with Duke Dennis from AMP? Later. How long before y'all can have sexual intercourse after the procedure? I didn't have sex for like three months. In I fear, think. in fear of it, like exploding during or something. So it hurts. Like oh. they got it's, it where they do up? the lipo at. We you supposed to get massages and stuff. It like leaks. Yeah, but your shit healed now though. All, all this shit healed. It's true. So you can fuck now. Yeah. Okay. It's true. No, I wait. No, I wait. I mean, I got it a year ago. So yeah. <laughs> 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 hey, Jay, I ain't mean that no type of way. I'm just, I'm just curious. Yeah. <laughs> What's your thoughts on a golden shower? Carisha, please. <laughs> no. So what you mean go to shoppers like they pee on you or you pee on them? Either way. I don't. I don't cut my lie. sprinkler system on. I ain't gonna lie. I'm a girl. What that mean? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no shade. I'm a girl. <laughs> I'm a girl. So when I be like. What is it? Sprinkler system? You got a sprinkler system? When I have an orgasm, okay, and I'm pushing, like 
as much as come out, like, as I'm squirting, I be feeling like, am I pissing on this Jada, why are we fighting outside of bars parking lot? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what happened? Cool me in on that. Where you got the fight in? I ain't know that. You got the fight in? I'm hearing about this, honey. Let's get into it. That was a fake question, right? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you ain't do nothing like that. But we classy. You ain't do nothing like that. All right. You shop at Kroger now? I thought we only shop at Publix and Home Foods and Sprouts. You tell me shop at Kroger on Old National? Like them bitches? I... I was fighting outside you bar. One night. I don't remember. It was last year. <laughs> <laughs> I was fighting outside you bar parking lot. No, you was not. Don't do that, motherfucker, because I'm about to spill your beans. Don't do too much. <laughs> don't do too much. This is my And Dion, Dion, <laughs> the host, is really laughing because she playing too, because this motherfucker. Y'all ask some crazy ass questions on this truth to drink. But this motherfucker was there too. Who was there? I got in a fight. I don't remember that. I'm not taking no more shots. Fuck that. I got in a fight. Cause I got into it with somebody. Baby mama, nigga I used to a nigga I used to fuck with. His baby mama I had got into it. With her about six months ago, earlier, just you know, Flash. in the beginning of, the, of last year, I got into it with her. Six months later, I'm in the car smoking with these fools, and uh -huh. somebody pull up to the side of the car, like they're like, "Hey, you want that fake?" I'm like, "No, uh no, no, no. What, what you say? Hey, you, you still, still want that?" that? I thought she was talking about like I'm thinking she time. went she didn't buy some weed on the low. She said, Hey, you still want that? I'm like, I'm cl I'm reaching down, like I'm clutching something because like we and you by parking lot. Why the fuck is somebody pulling up on us? So she like, Hey, you still want that? I look at Dion, I'm like, you was buying some weed? <laughs> like he was about to buy some? You got some. And she's like, you still want that fame? I'm like, oh, I know who you are. I'm like, okay. So, it was somebody baby mama that, you know, we had gotten to it six months ago when I was on that, like, hey, I'm pissed off. I'm not fucking with you. You keep on playing with me. Ran it. Like, she wasn't on that. But six months later, I'm not, talk I'm not worried about you. I'm not talking to your baby daddy. I'm not worried about your baby daddy. I got a whole nother nigga. You see me popping now, bitch. You see me on your screen. You see me. And even you can block me all you want, you still gonna see me because somebody gonna share me shit. So, I feel like maybe that's what happened. But, yeah, that was crazy. Have you ever had a threesome? No, I haven't no, had a threesome. I've never had a threesome. I want one. You okay. Want one with a girl and a, a girl and a boy, or a boy and a girl. A boy. I want a, a girl and a boy. You want a girl? Yeah. You nasty. No, not really. I, I I told you I have a thing for couples. I told you that. 
I've been told you that. Remember, I told so, you. So, wait, I like, you like to fuck a girl and her boyfriend? No, I just like the look of it. What's the look of it? I don't know. I like. You co- like coochie a little bit. I like. I'm starting to realize you get older now. No, okay, so like I like, like I like <laughs> aesthetically pleasing men and women together. Like I really like Victor Cruz and Karuchi when they were together and did something for me. Tiana, Iman, like sometimes they're sexy, they're hot. Yeah, like I like seeing. Yeah, I want that. You will like. No, I'll be involved. Go and eat eat my big pussy right now. Oh, that's kind of. <laughs> Go over there and eat on her right now. What I said. <laughs> you going to go over there and lick on that on that coochie? It's pink too. You know. You nasty. You thinking about it? No, cause I, I don't know. I don't know. It just do something for me. What do something for you? Like. Being older, I see it. <laughs> what do you think I'm going to be straight? Did you ever date the guy who you were in the billboard with, Jada? Huh? Did you ever date the guy who you were in the billboard with? Um, no, that's a stupid question. Why do you even think I be dating people? It's not the one with a little sushi date or something. That's all they think is like, oh, she want a little sushi day. Here's I don't want no sushi day with him. I know, but I'm just saying, you saying that, like, what's the worst that can come from somebody speculating about a date? What's Here's going, a date. What's going on dates on the curve? When you got flew out to Philly, did you sleep with the guy who flew you out on the first night? Speaking about me and my man, my man, would you eat your man's butt if asked? What's your answer, Chris? How long we been dating, baby? What you mean? How long? How hypothetically, how long we been dating? That's your man. That's my man. You're right. That's my man. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, baby. That's some freaky shit like that. (laughs) I like that type of shit. I'm going to ask him to do something like that. (laughs) Damn, baby. You a freak. I don't know if I can keep up with you, baby. Asking me to eat your fucking ass. What the fuck? I'm gonna have to drink, take a shot. Even if I wanted to put my whole face in your ass. I'm not about to talk about that on the air, man. What the fuck? What type of freaky questions y'all be asking? I'm not about to talk about if I put my tongue in a nigga butt. The fuck? Let me drink. You drinking too? Because you're not talking about that either. Drink. Come on. Take your shot. We're not drinking. Well, We're not talking about eating no nigga ass. ass. We're I'm not talking about. <laughs> <laughs> If y'all watch part one, go watch 
part one. <laughs> okay. So last question. What is your biggest goal for 2024? I'm gonna have to take another shot. Why? <laughs> I feel comfortable telling y'all, but like, the internet, I don't want to. That is facts. You don't want to tell them nothing no. before it, it goes into work. That's yeah. Facts. No, seriously. <laughs> Manifesting is okay, and talking about it amongst my friends is perfectly fine. But with y'all, it's like we have to get closer. We have to develop a relationship. And if y'all don't like, comment, and subscribe to this channel, <laughs> <laughs> then we don't have that relationship. And I don't feel comfortable sharing this intimate thing with you guys. Yeah. So make sure you please like, comment, and subscribe, and leave that code below if you want a chance to win. The cash prize. Yes. And after y'all subscribe, make sure that y'all drop the code word so you can be entered into the $50 Visa gift card giveaway. I have two winners this time. Last year I did one, but we're giving away $100, so I have two winners of $50 Visa gift cards. You have to drop the code word in the comment and make sure you subscribe. The code word is shade. shade. The code word is shade. Yes, baby, because it's been getting shady. Y'all have been asking some crazy ass questions. So drop the code word. Make sure you subscribe. We about to wrap this up. I know y'all. We're about to turn up. Yeah. So play games. It was nice. Everybody yeah, see no a bars. shot. Take a shot. Damn, I don't pull the couch apart again. I got pissed.